craft room. <laughs> it's getting hot in here. I might have to turn my air conditioner on. All right, let's try this again. I've been trying so many times today <laughs> to get this video right. <sighs> okay, hi. All right, Kelly Snow. Junk Journal Junkies, etc. And Bygone Friday Shop on Etsy. And I am throwing down some sewing stuff this weekend. <laughs> I'm having too much fun here. Alright, so I tried to do as much pre ahead of time as I could get organized. So I printed out Daisy Collins Fussy Cuts, the sewing stuff that she just launched this weekend or last weekend. I've gone completely berserko with it. So I cut them all out, inked them all up. They're sitting right here waiting. Then I got scraps, paper scraps, and scraps on scraps. Just strips, because I'm going to take the paper strips that we all have, all these, and make stuffs. Okay? So I got pink and I have plain colored. See, so look. And then I just have a couple. I don't want this one. And then I just have a couple different just scraps. I want to use up my dang scraps. Uh. <laughs> so here I am. Okay, then I went and got out pink Sean just got me this one from a garage sale today, another one, and some of this and this. So I have some chenille kits in my shop, slow stitch kits, if you're looking for, um, you know, something to take with you for traveling. They're really great. And then also I have all these lace panels and different lace panels and, you know, doilies and all kinds of stuff. If you're needing some, I have big, huge packs, and then I have small packs, too. So, anyway, this is sitting here waiting. Okay, and this is scrap work, so this is fun. You don't have to think about anything, really. I mean, you know, it's scrap work, so what are we going to do, you know? And I got these, and I got these. So, okay, the only thing, and then I got this. And usually when I do sewing journals, I like it to say just sew. But right now it says needles on it, so that's cute. I don't know, I'm just going to leave it and we're just going to use it for like whatever, you know. So all I'm doing is with these strips is I'm just making little flip ups. So I just fold it over like this. That's it. And then I'm just going to, on these flip ups, I'm doing... Just to be cute, I need eight of these because I have eight little books, so each one's going to get one. So I just need eight. It doesn't even matter, and I'm just going to freaking go to town. And this is cream color, so I'm going to cut some pink off. And we are just going to... I hate to cut this, but I'm going to do it. It's a pillowcase, and it has... Of rose on the front and a cross on the back. I love it a lot. But, you know, <clears throat> it's been sitting around for years. And I'm not meaning any disrespect, but <laughs> but I'm cutting it. And it's going to be used for something else. And I'm going to use every single piece, too, because, you know, you know, how we are with our stuff. So I just want to hang a piece of something off the end of my paper like this and then have a piece of something like this on top of that. So I just want to layer a little bit, obviously, right? So we'll just, I'll just snip it off. I was going to rip it, but 
not gonna happen. So we'll just snip it off. This will be cute. Any way we want to do it, it'll work out. Some way, or I could do. Uh, I could do it on another piece too. Hold on. I also have this sitting here, and it's pink and white dots. That's really cute. But I just want two of these. I'm gonna save that one for the next one. I really like it. So I'm going to do this one on here. Just like this. Like that. And you, and here's the deal is I could actually sew this too. And it would be pretty easy. Just a one line, you know. But... I'm going to just glue it because that's what we're doing for fun. Hi, guys. Hi, Linda. I am using these. I'm trying to see. Now I got my piles are so high. I can't even see what you're saying. <laughs> I know. Hi, happy scraps. All right. Let's see if I can get this glue to this glue to start working. So I was thinking I like to have, maybe I should put this on the top because I was going to put the word needles on the bottom. So I was thinking I'll just glue this on the top and I don't want it too heavy because this is just a piece of paper, but it's already kind of heavy because, you know. I'm stacking already, but we'll just, we'll just try it and see if it's going to be okay. <laughs> so I'm just, took a piece of that and take a piece of this. We'll just smash them together. <laughs> and then should I use cheesecloth to Pete's sake? And I didn't bring any of it out here. It's here somewhere, but you know. But you know. I know I have some white stuff sitting here somewhere. For Pete's sakes, here it is. Here it is. I got it. Don't curse me. So, what are you guys doing, Linda, today? Sean's out there laying us patio blocks for our porch because it always gets muddy right when you walk in the door so he's putting ah don't fall down he's putting blocks on for us and I am in my craft room and on YouTube <laughs> I know I should get cheesecloth, but I didn't. I got eyelash trim. So I'm going to just have to deal with it. There. And then this, we're going to put needles because that's going to be cute. Right? There's the S. Okay. And then I'm going to put it down here. Oh, I don't want to get ink all over everything. I know I always do those, so I might as well just face it now. <laughs> and I never seem to do it straight. Needle. My S didn't come out. I don't know why. It looks like a C. But it was an S for sure. I don't know why I did that. I'll never get it back on there, just like I just had it. So, how am I going to do it? The S, just the S? What are the odds? I'm really going to screw it up. But I'm going to try just for fun. Er, kind of. <laughs> I might faked it. Uh, but that's cute. Okay. 
so it's just a little flip up that I'm gonna glue down right here and it's just a cutie little thing and it's just cute you know so I'm gonna make eight of those and I'm gonna make when it comes up here I'll show you let's see here's some more scraps here's another one these are kind of skinny but we could do a pink one ooh this one's pretty with the dots and I like it to be ripped on the bottom and this one's ripped so we could do two like this see we're gonna do scrappies scrappy tablets and we're gonna do flip ups so this is looking like or we could just do flip up like this too or a scrappy tablet whatever is cute so let's see I got a long piece this so that is pink already so that means I need a white instead we're gonna cut this baby look at it oh I'm scared <laughs> no I'm not Okay, and we'll just put this on the top, like that, and then we'll put a chunky one over top of that. I even brought some chenille over here in case, in case I got to wanting some. And we'll put this here, let me get my glue. Okay, so lace. Yeah, what you doing? Huh? Well, if you do turn the air on, do you mind and shut everything up? It's hot. Okay. Sean said he's going to come in maybe there. So we'll just put that there. And then cute it's hot yeah and then we can put maybe this on top that looks cute well I just like that and then we'll do the eyelash trim since I didn't get my cheesecloth <laughs> we'll use white eyelash trim and I already inked up all this stuff I have variety pack of eyelash trim in my shop if you need some you just get 15 yards whatever I got you know I'm not so fussy I can't stand selling one little three yards of eyelash trim for two dollars <laughs> you know what I mean like I can't take it it's just it's not in my <laughs> can't do it so I sell like 15 yards five yards each you know something like that so I can you know Otherwise, it makes me crazy. So, here, we'll just put this here. Ooh, it's cute. It's talking about a dress form. And then this is all, um, oh, you work today? Okay. And you made dinner. Yeah, we just had, like, deli stuff, you know, pasta and stuff from the deli because I didn't feel like it. It's too hot. You don't have any hearts to click? <laughs> you gotta show off your bygones order. That's right, girl. Hi, Kristen. You're looking for the buttons to click on? You give me some hearts, man. So these are cute. So we're gonna make eight of these. We're just using scraps, Kristen. It's not, um... see, I'm just making little flip ups. And you just glue them down and they're just little flip ups on your page and put needles on the bottom so here's another one just out of a piece of scrap here so i'm gonna try doing this stamp again see if i can get the s this time oh, let's see if i can do it oh, it would help if i could see i do have my glasses in here though at least All right, 
and I'm going to put something underneath because I always mess it up. So let's see if I'll get it this time. <laughs> oh, and then it's upside down. How oh, you like that? Finally got it, and then it's upside down. Oh, Evie. Can you imagine? Now what? Now it's going to be all messed up. Here, I'll just rip it off. <laughs> Re-ink it, for Pete's sakes. And glue it on the right way. Oh, I can't. Oh, yeah, I can. There. I was going to say, I hope I didn't put needless. <laughs> oh, I'm going to keep that for a different one, not because it's really bugging me. Linda, finally get that all right, and then I do it backwards. All right, I ripped it off. I'm going to do it straight this time, hopefully. <laughs> I did it. Yay. Evils. These are cute. I like these. So I need eight of them. And then... So let's find another piece that's like long and skinny strip here. These are cute. These we'll use for something else. I like the long strips. Here's one. We'll just use this one. And we'll just fold it like this. And we'll do the same thing. We'll just cut a piece off my pink. We'll use pink, pink this time. Part piece of the cross. <laughs> there, this will be cute. I think maybe this time we'll use the needles because it's so long and skinny. There's a big knot right here. I'm just gonna cut it off. It's bugging me. All right, so we'll just, let's just do it. Just glue it down. No thinking. Like that. Then we'll take another piece of this. Sean just got me this at a sale for a quarter. <laughs> I'm cutting it up already. You might as well use it. Might as well use it, or it's just going to sit there for 10 years while you're looking at it. <laughs> That's what I keep doing. Okay, so earlier this morning I had a sewing video and we made these cute little, fat little chubbies. So I got those all done. And now I'm working on these, so I figured I'd come back and see what you guys are doing. This is cute. These are Tsunami Rose Fussy Cuts, so you can, I put the link there, I think. And then you just put that on and it's cute, all done. I love how easy it is. You just put a couple pieces on and put your die cut on top and put your thing on. And I'm just making eight of these for, for my deal. For my wall of inspiration, little things. They're turning out cute. There, and these are cute um, little Daisy Collins fussy cuts. I gotta hold this one down because it's gonna be messed up if I don't. There. This is cute, and I'm gonna do needles again and hope I Get it straight. <laughs> I did. These will be cute. I love these little scrappies. Look how cute these are. I like them. Cute. I love these. We got three so far of these kind. They're cute. I like them. Ooh, look, we'll do a bobbin next. How cute is that? 
All right, let's find a sheet we can make a flip out. A little flipper. This one's already folded. We could use this one. All right, let's do it. And then we're going to make scrappy tablets as well. And then I'm going to take all this cutie stuff I'm making and I'm going to put it in the little books. I got a part one little tutorial on these little envelope needle books I'm making. They're so cute. But I got to make a couple things to go inside. So, hi, babes. Hey. Did you get all cleaned up? Yeah. Okay. Sweating out there. Yeah, it's hot. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Love Put you. The TV on or okay. Or whenever you're done? Yeah. Anybody's in here with you? Yeah, no. he's in here with me. Okay. Alright, so we're going to put this here. I would love it if you'd bring me my coffee cup. I'm really sorry to bug you. Is it heated up? You can heat it up for me. Where is it? It's on the white bench, you know, on the way out, on the table. I'm sorry. You don't have to, but. Okay, so the piece of lace, then we'll do the little chunky monkey here. At least just one hunk, if nothing else. You gotta have one hunk of, hunk of chunka on there. Or it's just not right. Okay, and then I'm going to put the little bobbin on there. That's going to be so cute. Oh my goodness. Is, is this the cup? Here? Yes. Okay. Thank you. All right. There's this. Whoops, and I forgot my eyelash trim. I just want a the little... Coffee. Yeah, that's from this morning. It's really good still. I love that coffee shop. I oh. get um, decaf latte with oat milk. That's what I get when he goes uptown. Cute little bobbin. Oh, that's cute. All right. And then we'll, you're watching on your iPad. It's really hard to type, but you're here. Okay. I wonder, I forget now what you said you were making, Kristen. I forget now what you said. I know you showed me and stuff, but. You know, I forget. Linda, are you making stuff too? Oh, what did you say? You're going to get something to eat and get yourself to your craft room. <laughs> there this is cute I love these I got four yeah, done thank you oh man yeah that's plenty hot thank you thank you oh that's good yes thank you very much love you okay let's see let's do another pink one because we got a lot of and this one's already folded over on the top, so maybe we'll just. Oh, I don't want it folded that way though. This way, it's cuter. So we'll do another little one like this. Cute. And then we'll do needles on the bottom. Oh, these are cute. the white one. I love me an assembly line. <laughs> I love me an assembly line. Okay, this is going to go here. I love this pink paper that I do. I'm just obsessed with it. I have a secret way I do it. And I'm never telling. <laughs> uh, I have a secret way. 
to do my favorite pink. Do you have secrets, Linda, that you'll never tell? <laughs> oh, snippet rolls, that's right. Yeah, Kristen's doing snippet rolls, I forgot. I was gonna use some today, too. I have several that gals have given me, and so I need to get using them. So I hung them over here. So maybe the next craft I do, I'm gonna use the snippets, we'll see. We'll see. This is adorable. And then this, I think I'm just gonna. This one is even needles. Oh yeah, you got secrets. I got so many secrets. I'm not telling everybody everything. <laughs> Right, Linda? I can't wait, Linda. You know, on my other desk is um, all your eco stuff. I've been saving it for how many years did you give that to me ago? Like three or four. <laughs> three at least. I've been hoarding it this whole time. You know how you got to hoard the good stuff? Oh, my God. But it's sitting out there. And all the stuff Kristen gave me and, like, I've had a couple other people send me some too, you know, like... And there's so many botanical projects that I want to do. Oh my God. So I'm really excited, but I have to get my wall of inspiration caught up before Christmas comes. Otherwise I can't live with myself. I forgot my eyelash trim, but I think on this one, it's going to be okay. So I got to get my walls of inspiration all caught up. I don't know how caught up I'm going to get, though. I've only made eight, but I do have some tags over here. Some people just send you just a plain old tag. Like, I don't know. I don't even like to send back. I'm sorry. I'm just that way. It's like, why waste your time sending me something like that? <laughs> you know what I mean? I mean, I just don't. Like, I know I got to spend $350 because my stuff's going to be over a quarter inch thick, so I'm going to make it worth it. Like, I'm not going to send you some stupid plain tag that you make you know you know what I'm saying oi so shoot you know I want to make something fun <laughs> fun you know anyway this one's really cute it says needles and that's one of the fussy cuts from Daisy Collins's new sewing kit that she's got out now it's really cute how many do we got these now one two three four, five. Okay. Jeez. We still need three more. Shoot. Shoot. All right. Here's a pink one. We could use this one. It's kind of short, but we can still use it. I know, but I get... I just got one the other day. Just, you know, a tag with a couple... It's cute, though, the layering, you know. You know, there was, like, three things, and it's just, you know, Mod Podge, and that's it. And it's fine. It's just, I don't know. All of inspiration is supposed to be inspirational. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, and I just get so tired of the same old tag that it's just, I just don't send them out anymore. Like that, you know. I want to have something fun. So I can go to my wall of inspiration and be like, what can I make? You know, I'm tired. And sometimes that's the problem is you just don't know what you feel like making until something gets in your hand. And you're like, oh, this is cool. It takes two seconds to, you know, get inspiration from somebody. So, yeah, unless there's something cool about it or some kind of, you know, technique done on it or something, then I'm just bored with it. I don't mean to be rude, but I'm just saying, yawn, you know. <laughs> I want to have something kind of interesting. Otherwise, what's the point of sending it and sending back and all the courtesies and all that? I know, you know, be kind is like the thing. <laughs> you know what I mean? But I don't know. I just don't, you know, I don't know. It's like value for value. And I just don't want to mess around 
with something, you know, that's not going to be funnest, you know, best quality, you know what I'm saying? Man, I just, this is so short and all it says is needles. There's no, if I put more words on there, it's just more words. I don't know. It just doesn't look right. This is too big for this one. Maybe not though. I mean, I guess we can put that on. It's pretty cute. Let's just do it. But it looks cute just the way it is, too. But I know, yeah, tags are boring. I just think they're boring unless, you know, there's something really cool about it or something fun, you know, or something that moves or, you know, something. It's got to be something. Or, you know, I'm bored. All right, we'll just do that. Even if it's too big, oh, well. Do I need two more now? I just counted and forgot already. <clears throat> it must be because I had eight. Eight things sitting here. So it must be. So I got these two left to do. That's cute enough. Okay, let's do... Another one of these. These are all scraps. You know, just scraps. That's what I like. Scrappy dappies, and then you're getting rid of the stuff. So to me, it's like super fun because my scrap box, when my scrap box gets full, then, then I feel like I have to empty it, you know? <laughs> you know what I mean? So, and I like... <clears throat> I think the funnest work is using all the scraps. To me, that's the funnest time. I have the funnest time doing that. Okay, this and then a loop-de-loop. -loop. We need a chunky monkey here. Where am I cutting at? I guess I'm just cutting all over on this thing. We'll just put a piece of chunky monkey down. And then we'll put this one on, I guess. Like this. And then we'll put this. And my eyelash trim. And then we'll, we got one more of these to do. And then... Then we'll start on the little tablets, which normally I sew at the top. <sighs> and just rip the bottoms and it's just a cute little thing, you know. Oh, cute. And I wanted to wax something, and I didn't wax anything either yet. So maybe that's going to be my next project is waxing something. Ooh, I love it. I love being assembly line. I'm just saying. All right, where's my, where did I put it? My little needle thing. Oh, here it is. <clears throat> These are cute. I just like them. Okay, we got one more and then we'll make the tablets. Ah, that is such good copy. This one, I guess, we'll just use this one and we'll just fold it over on the top just to make a little flip up. This is gonna go on it. So we need pink first, which is right here. that down and then we get a chunky on top of that. You've never waxed Linda? Oh my gosh. Oh nice. 
Nice. Yeah, you better get moving because I'm going to be using your eco soon and then everybody's going to want it. So you better <laughs> better get your button gear because I'm going to be doing it next. Um, honestly, though, I don't think there's that big of a rush because after this weekend, which is just going to be this, I have to work on my woman's circle meeting and then my daughter's coming for a week so after she leaves then I'm going to start the botanical and dig out my Christmas so you actually have you know probably two weeks before I you know what I mean so you don't have to rush so that's nice right yeah this ain't looking too good on there is it I don't like it I don't like the way it looks. Okay, well then. Guess I want to use something else because that ain't looking right. And I don't have nothing sitting here, of course. Shoot. I'm looking for something. I know I have something, but... Let me see. I got my little sewing box down here. I probably got something... I just want to use something different than that. I don't like the size. How about if we use, this is all Tsunami Rose stuff. We could just use a little bobbin or one of these. Ooh, this will be cute. Let's use this. This one's cute. It's pink and little flowers on it. Thimble, these are so cute. Let's just use this one. Adorable. Just didn't work out for the shape wise. Shape wise, it just didn't work. So I'll use it somewhere else for a little tucky or something. And we'll put this little thimble on there. Oh, so cute. I love it already. So cute. Should have got cheesecloth, but ah, I use eyelash trim. It's fine. It's fine. It just makes a big bump, but it's okay. That is so cute there. I like it. Yes, you got a little timeline. Yeah, I think I want to do wax next. Of course, I could wax these, but I know I'm going to need one more project, I think, probably. We'll see. I don't know. I don't have to get too fancy. I'm trying to keep it, you know, a little simple on myself because i got to make eight of them. But I still want to make them nice, so these are cute. Okay, I got eight little guys here. That's adorable. And then we'll make some little tablets. And the little tablets, I'm gonna rip a little piece of paper for the top and then have like, what should we do? Um, let's just look, I was gonna rip off like a rose or something. So I had started one here. There are just all the, you know, strips folded over. So I just folded it over and then we'll put a pink one here. We could do another pink one here. Like how many do you think we should do? Four or five? Four? What do you think? So it looks like good. We could do it like this. I like just scrappy, you know what I mean? I love that. Maybe one more just for fun. What do you want in the front? That's the thing. Pink or the, I like the pink in the front, of course. But I could always just put this on here because that's cute. And then I'm holding that all together because I was actually going to sew. These are rejects off my printer because they got the lines in them, but I save them because you can rip. And I just rip 
off some like this. I always like to rip. And then I can just put it on here like this. So I gotta ink the edge. I wanna wax too. I think we're gonna wax the next project I do. We'll do some waxing and it's probably gonna be the Vintage Ladies because I'm mixing this with Vintage Ladies. See, so I go like this, sweet, and then I just sew over the top. Just a straight line and make a little scrappy and it's cute and it's useful. And I'm using up my scraps. And then it has sewing on it. And look, it's cute. And you can ink the edges if you want to to make them, you know, stand out a little more. But look, cute. So there's one. <laughs> Seven more to go. All right, so I just fold my papers. And I like to mix it up between the pink and the... And I like to mix up the widths so it all looks messed up. It's kind of fun. There. This one's cool. I like it. And then I, like I said, I just rip out a piece I want to use. Since it got wrecked on my printer, I am not letting this go to waste, dang it. Ink my edge. So I appreciate you guys coming and sitting with me while I'm doing my little work here. It's, you know, eight of the same thing, so <laughs> over and over again. There, look. And then you just run a strip and you got these cute little scrappies. They're cute. I like my little scrappy tablets and it's just using up all my scrap strips. Here. It's adorable and I love having the little threads hanging down. So, so that's cute. See, we got two. Cute. All right, let's get another one done. Do it to it. There's two. We'll do a skinny one here. This one looks like it's going to be skinny. I need eight of these, so we'll see how it all works out here. <laughs> I like that one on the top because it's so nice. So let's see how we can do this one. You got lots of scraps, Linda. I know Kristen probably does too. It's nice to have little scrappy projects. Um, I can't remember if I have wax in my shop. I used to, I can put some in. I had it. I just think I might be sold out, but I'm not sure. I forget, I'll have to go look. I had cute little packs with the little bees and stuff, the little bee. So I might have it. I might, but I can't remember. I have to look. Oh, this is little. Shoot, I gotta do a little one. Let's do this. <laughs> I wasn't cutting this, ripping the size here. This one's tiny. Cutest. Oh, for cute, okay. So let's do that. Let's wax. Let's wax, Kristen said. <laughs> I will, but I can't do this one. We'll do it next. I got to get these done first, and then I got to get my vintage ladies out, and then we can wax. That'll be fun. Okay, let me put my stitch across here. These are turning out cute. I love these. Cute. 
I'm not putting any word on the bottom of these so that they're still different from the other ones, I guess. So I got three done. Okay. Let's keep going here. I got this one started. This one, these ones, I'm going to show you. Oh, maybe we'll do three projects while we're sitting here. Because all these little skinnier ones, I got something for those two. And they're really cool. At least I like them. <laughs> here, I'm talking it up and you might hate it. But I did. <laughs> But I have one that I really like that I make out of those little strips. So just, just hold your horses a minute here now. All right, I gotta dig in my box here. I thought I had enough strips, but I don't. Okay. Oh, good, okay. Okay, that sounds good. Okay. This is cool. I like all the layers and colors and stuff. I mean, I could put pink on top, but I don't always have to have pink on top, you know. But I can. <laughs> My favorite pink here. All right, this is cute. And this one's way too big too. So let's do this, this little cutie right here. <clears throat> and then we'll ink. He went out to take the doggy for his evening walk after his dinner. He has a routine, the doggy. So usually I'm working all day, so I'm boring and I don't cater to the doggy's every whim, right? <laughs> And Sean gets home at 2.30, so then we start, you know, doing other things besides working, so. But, so the routine is, is when Sean gets home, he takes him down to the river, and then he goes in and takes a shower. And then, um, after he's done with the shower, then he has to play toys with the dog. So then they play. And then it's dinner time, so then he has to feed the doggy. And we feed our doggy um, rotisserie chicken. <laughs> Cause, and then he does have little crunchies, you know, like dog food and stuff, but dog food's crappy, so I just give him like meat, you know. And then after that, then he has to get his treats. You know, there's a certain order of things. And then after the treats, then, then we sit around for a while and then he gets his last walk. And that's where he's at right now. He's on his last little hoorah for the night. And so Sean's got, <laughs> Sean's got to take him. On one last, I always want to end it with pink. Oh, I got a sickness. Can't help it. See how cute these are? And then I might be able to use this one. I can. Yay. Finally. Yep. And then it used to be, you know, because he knows lots of words now. Because Romeo's been here for like, I think he's like seven. And he knows lots of words like, you know. He knows what going to Walmart means. He loves to shop and go get his chicken, you know. <laughs> he goes and gets his rotisserie chicken and then comes home and eats. So it's funny. Okay. And this goes on here. How adorable is that? I could almost go like this and it would be a tuck spot too. <gasps> I might have to. No, I won't because it'll ruin it. I can't. I gotta go straight across. Don't get any ideas. Come on with it. Let's 
going to cause me problems right now. No. All right, I got it. Yes, then cuddles. He cuddles with me in the evening and Sean in the morning. Sorry, I got it. I fixed it. I only got like 10%, so. Yeah, he cuddles with me in the evening. Every I go sit in my recliner and then he cuddles with Sean in the morning. So, cause I sleep on my recliner still, like still can't sleep in the bed yet. So, so anyways, we got one, two, three, four, five. I need three more and my battery's running out. So you guys know what I'm doing. So my battery is going to run out before I get to get to the last part. Darn it. That's okay though. That's okay. I wanted to be able to get it in here, but it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to. Because I don't have no dang battery. This is good enough though, actually. That's a good one. I just need a little piece to go on top. These are fun. I just need a little piece. This one's kind of small. I need my anchor. Where's my anchor? Shoot, oh, here it is. Yeah, so when we get up in the morning, then that's the first thing he wants to do is go lay in bed with Sean. <laughs> so he spends his morning in, in bed getting his belly scratched. <laughs> Such a good life. All right. There, these are cute. Thanks for hanging in there with me, you guys, today. That was really fun. Got a couple more of these to build and then I'll be done and I'll be on to the next project. So maybe we'll get some waxing done tonight yet, Kristen. We'll see. <laughs> okay. My battery's gonna run out. I'll go charge it up and then see if we'll be back and we'll break out some wax. Okay, bye.